<coughs> there we go. All right, cool. Uh, cool, 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 cool. Okay, cool, now cool. I'm 60. Uh, oh. Something about space flies. I don't know why it's talking to me about space flies. I don't when care about did space I flies. I suddenly coined 60. <laughs> Statistics, <coughs> log. Resources are not sold. Oh, there we go. Okay. Um, oh, we're in family pride. Got it. Yes, we are. We are in family pride. All right, I got a pretty good, uh, pretty good feel for the controls right now. Let me just remember which one's the fire button. Yep, there we go. Ooh, those are some powerful guns. Yeah, these guns, the Hulkster's guns. All right, I think I'm ready. So, hey, folks, it's Grimwit from NatEvil.com with my friend Chuck. Hi. And, um, let's finish this. Yeah, let's finish this. We can do it. Okay. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Yeah, worst case scenario, we don't. Yeah. Oh, um, so, I don't see really a lot of... So, so I head south, right? I just keep holding south and... That's a very good question. Why don't you wait until I look at the map and then I'll tell you. Because Where... I'm, I'm messing with controls. Okay. We're in family pride, you said, right? We are in family pride. Now, if I remember right, shift J makes things go all wonky. Oh, warp speed! Whoa! Shield's critical. <laughs> yeah, shield's critical. Best damn yeah. shields there are, and they're, they're critical. Okay, we want to head mm -hmm. to President's End. It's south of the wall. Oh my god, that's on the other side of the friggin... You know what? I'm not gonna freak out. <laughs> Are you just now remembering that this game is long and monotonous? So I'm at Family Pride. I assume I go west. Ah. Correct, sir? You're, you're gonna go very west. Okay. You're going to go west all the way to the hole, and then you're going to go south. Well, fortunately, we got some kind of crazy warp speed thing that helps. Yeah, unless we'll... unless there's somebody to fight, then we're screwed. Target now locked on we'll get there relatively Zerx quickly. Pride. And, of course, we need to remind everybody that I'm locked up in a closet in the ship, and I can't see or hear anything that you're doing. But I'm just the, giving the, you advice off of a map. Oh. Well, you know what? That's exactly what I need, though. I need advice off a map. Yeah, still, sometimes I wish I could see you explode stuff. You know what somebody in the and comments pointed out to me? Pride. No. They, they <laughs> pointed out to me that the, uh, the very first... Uh, the, I think they were trying to... to uh, I think they were trying to do something about Godwin's Law. They were pointing out that the the very first quote that I used to start these videos for for X Beyond the Frontier was a quote from a former Nazi. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, and I was thinking, you know what? If if I had uh, the the thought process to do it, I could have invoked Godwin's Law right there and then. Critical. And we wouldn't have had to go through this. <laughs> yeah. Do you, Whatever you say, mine Fuhrer. Do you know what, what Godwin's Law is, Chuck? Mm, does it involve reading? Sort of. Oh, okay. No, I don't know what it is. Okay, Godwin's Law is very simple. The longer a thread on a forum Target goes, the more Gate likely it is done. to turn into a discussion about the Nazis. And the more, as soon as somebody brings up Nazis, the argument on the forum will become so dumbed down that it will just have to be locked and thrown away. Like, everybody will be have to be locked out of the thread. Nobody could post on it ever again, entry that kind of thing. System, family design. So it's basically just the law of entropy. Yeah, 
yeah, it's it's the uh, it is the the likelihood that everything will be boiled down to its simple components. And apparently, when where the internet is evolved, internet discussions are all about Nazis at its simplest component. <laughs> wow. This boring conversation brought to you by X Beyond the Frontier. When you need boring, go to X. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Um, Where are you now? That's an excellent question. Uh, let me see. Family Zine. I'm, I'm headed north right now. I think so. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. You have to head north to head west. Yeah. Oh, and there is a bad guy right there in front of me. Let's see if we can be friends. Oh, yeah. This will be your first time trying out the big guns, won't it? Yeah. Yeah, I will. And I have no idea how good this is going to go. It better go pretty good, because you're about to go into Xenon space here pretty soon. So, hopefully this will work well. Otherwise, you will die. Huh. A lot. Huh. So... Best of luck to you. Well, this is the split territory. And the deal with the split territory is they don't let bad guys last for very long. And I have no clue. Oh, there it is. Good. Um, there, That guy's probably going to be dead by the time I get to him. Because he's headed north. In fact, you know what? Screw it. I'm just, I'm just going into hyperdrive. Critical. Prepare and for hyperspeed. Hyperspeed? No, throw away that useless crap. Prepare for ludicrous speed. <laughs> ludicrous speed. <clears throat> Attention, ladies and gentlemen. Prepare for ludicrous speed. Batten down all hatches. Cancel the Barn ba Bailey Circus. <laughs> Target now. Lock oh. on gate. Family. We. I have no shields, and I'm under attack. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, alright. That's right, right. The, the warp drive drains the shield. What? Yeah, the warp drive. Actually, I think this guy... Nope, never mind. He's... He is headed out of the system, so I don't think it's going to be a problem. Oh, wait. It looks very much like he's headed straight towards me. That might be a problem. Can I lock onto this guy? Target now. I can't. Yes. This is everything I dreamed it would be. Where is this guy? I mean, I can... Uh, one of these buttons, um... Ah, there Target we go! Now locked on. Unknown Xenon ship. Alright, cool. Alright, I got a guy locked onto my target. And... I'm closing in for the kill. Well, never mind, he disappeared. Target now locked <laughs> on. Gate. Family. We. Whoa, that was a close one. I was scared. Yeah. Me too. Hold me. Entering not, system, not family we. <laughs> this awkward moment brought to you by X, X beyond, beyond the frontier. The frontier. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, anybody. Target oh, hey, I got a target. On unknown Xenon ship. It's the same guy who went through, I think. So we're going to kick his ass. Target is now okay. in firing range. This shouldn't take you more than like one or two shots. Come on. Oh my god, he's still alive! The family Jin and the Strip Dynasty are appreciative of your valuable assistance. Reward, <laughs> you get 1,000 credits. Hey, the good news is he's dead. The bad news is it took down some of my shields. Not because he hit me with weapons. Rather, he hit me with his rear end. I don't know what he was doing backing up like that, but, uh, you know, I can handle it. Two ships in the entire sector. And you managed Target to rear end somebody. On pirate ship. <laughs> That's impressive. It's like coming home, isn't it? Your insurance premiums must be through the roof on this thing. No. This end. thing's got insurance? <laughs> well, technically, yeah. You buy insurance to save your game. Oh, hey, yeah. I didn't think about that. That's true. All right. Well, my insurance premiums, then, is about uh, 10 credits per dock station dock. That's Ridiculous. I don't know how much a credit is, but I want that insurance. I think a credit is about a dollar, so it's ten dollars. Now keep in mind, we have, <laughs> I think, about five billion dollars. So ten dollars, 
I'm, I'm not worried about ten dollars. Target now, <laughs> for, for the low price of ten dollars a month, should you completely destroy your vehicle and die in the blaze, <laughs> we will completely replace it and clone you for free. Sorry, <laughs> not for free. Ten dollars. <laughs> I like to think that there's actually some kind of eldritch occult Enemy magic going on here. <laughs> Alright, I am now in Talati Gain. Okay. Now I'm going to, what is it, President something or other? Yeah, you're going to need to go Target to... Now locked on. Split mm, Menelos? Menelos. That it's, sounds like a boron. Well, it's it's two to your it's two to the west. Okay. And yeah, then, that sounds very much like a boron station. So I'm good at or a boron space. So I think I know where that is. Okay. Shields. Once critical. you get there, you go. Yeah, you're you're correct. It's boron space. Target now locked on. Anyway. Boron dolphin. And when you get there, then you're gonna no go south. Aim. Whoa, whoa! I am way off course. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I just I just noticed my uh, my compass going crazy. Well, and by compass I mean radar, because you can see where the north, south, east, and west is, or at least the gates thereof. And I lost it. I don't know where I am. You know what? Fortunately, I have a map. And there's some guy fighting now, over there. On Taladi Trading Station. Okay, this guy is pissing me off, so I'm gonna go after him because. Target now locked on unknown xenon ship. You know what? I think he's dead. <laughs> oh, good job. Target ah, now there locked we go. on unknown xenon ship. You going down, unknown xenon ship? Hang on. Oh, there goes his shields. He's getting he's getting hammered. He's he's not gonna be around for very much longer. And he's dead. Yeah, that was that was not a waste of time at all. <laughs> so so many people in the entire world, Chuck, are trying to find love. No aim. I have found love, so so now what am I supposed to do? Whoa, almost crashed into that. <laughs> that would have been funny. Uh, you know what they say. No. If you love something, let it go. <laughs> and then you'll be in uh I guess alone. That's how that works, right? To be terribly, terribly alone. So I want to make sure I get this love thing down. Uh, you, you're saying that I should spend my entire life looking for love, and as soon as I find it, let it go. Yes. That's uh, if zen. You, if you can, actually try to find your love a better man to hook up with as an apology for having hooked up with you in the first place. So... I guess this is what it means to be not a zero, but a hero. <laughs> sure. Where am I? I am now in uh, Sio's Buckzoid, which, okay. by the way, is the most cowboy-sounding sector of space ever. Yes, it is. <laughs> and... Bright star in the way... There's, I don't see the... Uh, Oh, there it is. Yeah, I got it. Alright, I think I can do this. 